Hey guys, happy Mortgage Monday. Elise here. Behind the screen, I still don't know how to figure out how to film and flip without getting cut off. So here we are. Hey, I wanted to show and talk about something that's really prominent right now, which is both interest rates and prices of homes are both going up right now. So we still have an incredibly um, intense supply shortage, which is forcing home prices to go up combined with really strong demand and rates are going up because of everything that we've talked about. Inflation's going up, um, labor shortages, supply chains, the economy is pumped with a ton of stimulus money, all that fun stuff. But why that matters to you is because now more than ever, the cost of waiting is incredibly high. So I wanna kind of break it down of what that means. This report is just based off of Clackamas County, looking at a $450,000 home, um, if you're doing a conventional loan and say putting 5% down. That's what these numbers are based off of. Of course, we can customize this to your specific financial profile. But what I'm trying to illustrate here is the different um, timelines and how much money you're losing just by waiting around. So as you can see here, with property value, we are anticipating those to go up, but also with the interest rates, we're anticipating these to go up. And these figures are pretty conservative. So with those figures, what does that mean? Well, if you scroll down here, if you wait six months, you're losing out on about $17,000. It's gonna cost you $17,000 more to buy that same house. If you wait about a year, 36,000, 63.93. So I've had a lot of people say, well, I want to buy a house, but it costs me about $2,500 to break my lease. And it's like, you know what? That's totally valid. That is a chunk of change. However, if we compare numbers to numbers, I would rather you pay the $2,500 to break your lease so that you could save $17,000. So it's all just chunking it down into the data, into the analytics to see what is in your best interest and what makes the most sense for you. I'm here for you guys if you have any questions, if you need anything, um, and also just keep praying for our country, for our nations, for our world, um, and for lifting up people and just being a positive light. So I hope you guys have a great week. Take care.